So it was chaos. Um, I was in active addiction, found out that I was pregnant, and then I decided that I could not and would not feed a fetus poison. So I went to rehab. <coughs> um, it was my third time at Gospel Rescue Mission. So I knew the program, I knew the people, I knew that I could be successful there. I had three other children, Brian, Penny, and Richard. Brian is my oldest. Um, Penny is my middle, and Richard is my youngest, and they're all teenagers. And at the time, they had been with DCS, or in Brian's case, running from DCS for about two years. Um, so I was actively fighting a DCS case. Um, so when I found out that I was pregnant and I made the decision to get clean, it started a chain of events that were actually really good. Um, I started being able to have visits with my kids. Um, I entered a program to help me get my kids other than what they offered at Gospel. Um, so in that, the kids, Brian, Penny, and Richard saw that I was actually getting back to where they needed me to be. Everybody was excited. My daughter, Penny, was extremely excited. Um, she wanted to name her. When we found out that it was a girl, she had decided on the name Casey Marie Elizabeth. Um, and she just was so, so excited to have a little sister because she has two brothers two older brothers, one older brother, one younger brother. So she was just excited to have another girl. And my boys were just excited to have another sibling. When I went for my five month ultrasound, they tried to find Casey's heartbeat. The big monitor right in front of me and them searching for a heartbeat. It was devastating. They finally told me that there was no more heartbeat, that she had passed. And they couldn't tell me why. Um, they offered to do a genetic test, which I asked, I accepted because I wanted to know if it was something that I did. because I had been in active addiction for the first month of my pregnancy. Um, so I wanted to see if it was something that I did. They wanted to get me into the hospital as soon as possible so I could actually deliver Casey. But I also processed that maybe her only purpose in life was for me to get clean. That maybe that was the only reason God gave her to me. <laughs> the only thing she ever knew was my heartbeat. The voices of the people that loved her. The safety of inside of me. Her name actually means watcher. So that's, Penny did a good job naming her, especially because 
she does watch over all of us. My name is Laura and I'm Scarred Beautiful.